It's not very often that we get good news from the Supreme Court. Today is one of those days. The Supreme Court rejects the bid to restrict access to abortion pill, you know, mifepristone. Back in March, I went to DC. I did risk getting arrested. That was a risk we knew we were told going in. And it was important enough for me to risk being arrested to help try to save and preserve the rights of American women and everybody who has a uterus. So it was a unanimous decision to uh, keep mifepristone on the market, but not because of human rights, but because the doctors who brought the lawsuit didn't have a dog in the hunt, to be blunt. Now this is the other one that we are waiting on, Idaho versus United States. We were expecting this to come out today. It has not yet. If you aren't familiar with this lawsuit, this is what it's about. Whether the Supreme Court should stay the order by the U.S. District Court for the District of Idaho enjoying the enforcement of Idaho's Defense of Life Act, which prohibits abortions unless necessary to save the life of the mother on the grounds that the Emergency Medical Treatment and Labor Act preempts it. So Idaho has one of the most restrictive and horrible laws that is hurting women every single day. And I really, really hope that SCOTUS does the right thing on this, but I don't think they're going to. Unfortunately, I think that they are going to stand with no health care for women in Idaho. Tell me in the comments what you think and, you know, do all the things. It helps.